first for you, President Gentiloni, I wanted to ask you, we saw from this new administration a new type of policy on the international scene, very different from what we had in the past. And one of the last important operations which, which was carried out by President Trump was in Syria with a bombing of following the use of chemical weapons by the Assad regime. I wanted to ask you, does Italy think or conceive a possibility uh, to take action in more acting in, more acting in Syria? Since my colleague from Fox News did, so I'm going to take as well the possibility to ask you two questions. First of all, um, about European Union. You have said in the past that Brexit was a great thing and that you think that other countries will follow. So you know that Italy is an important player and supporter of European integration. Uh, do you believe that actually a strong Europe is important from, for the United States also looking forward at the French election? And then the second question is that you said that you're looking forward to come to Italy for the G7, and I wanted to know if you're also looking forward, if it's going to be possible to meet Pope Francis during your Italian trip. Thank you. Uh, Syria. Uh, Syria. We immediately assessed the operation that was ordered by President Trump and decided that this is a motivated response to the use of chemical weapons. We added that it's up to everyone to consider negotiation as the road through which we hopefully can put an end to this infinite dramatic war and come to peace. Italy is not directly involved in the operations and the military operations in Syria other than marginal aspects. But it's not our plan to change this attitude. Yes, uh, a strong Europe is very, very important to me as President of the United States. And it's also, in my opinion, in my very strong opinion, uh, important for the United States. Uh, we want to see it. We will help it be strong. And it's very much to everybody's advantage. And I look very much forward to meeting the Pope. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.